so we're carrying on with our mini-series with Ray Hunt and his wonderful book, Think Harmony with Horses. And the words of wisdom I'd like to choose for today are, instead of a hard tightness, try to find a soft firmness. Uh, I love that way of thinking of things. So when I learned about classical equitation, one of the big phrases they use in that is, hard as steel, soft as silk. Or maybe it's nicer the other way around, soft as silk, hard as steel. So an easy example of that perhaps is with the rain. So when you have a nice contact and you're going with the horse, you really have a feel that's as soft, soft, soft and delicate as silk. Uh, if the horse was to pull on you or whatever, then you can be hard. So it's not to have a grey area in the middle. It's either one or the other. It's either yes or no. Um, but I like this idea much more of saying firm than of saying hard. So we can be firm, we can put our foot down, block our hand, whatever it is we need to do, whether it's keeping the horse out of space when we're leading him. Um, but to think of it as being firm, soft firmness, rather than being hard, just gives a different intention behind it, I think. So that's our thought for today. It's also very related with being clear, having a clear intention, being clear what you want, being 100% behind your decision, making sure the conscious decision in your mind is backed up by your subconscious feeling, uh, that you're not telling yourself some bullshit story, that you're not good enough to ride your horse or train your horse or do whatever you're doing with your horse. So yeah, be clear, be firm, but with softness. Thank you.